This is Ken Patera. That's right, the famous Ken Patera. Ken, I didn't realize I was this famous. I can't go anywhere anymore. You think Hulk Hogan has a bad time of it? Ken Patera has a worse time. And the thing is, this tournament I'm competing in, the TKN tournament, my next opponent is Jeremy London. Now, Jeremy London has quite a reputation. He was a heartthrob in the 90s. He uh, uh, made uh, the mole rats. Uh, he was on the party of five. Uh, so the guy has credentials. I don't know how much of a competition he's going to give me. Probably not, because he's a young guy. He's 40 years younger than I am. You know, now, I I, I grew up earlier, and, uh, you know, beach blanket bingo with Frankie Avalon and Annette Funicello. Uh, you know, uh, invasion of the body snatchers. Anybody remember that? Of course you do. Uh, but those were two of my favorites. And uh, I, I hate to admit it, Beach Blank Bingo, but I was a kid, Jesus. What, what was I? I was 13, 14 years old when that movie came out. And, you know, I'm pushing 80 now. So, anyway, uh, uh, I got some notes here. And uh, I can't even read them. I can't even write anymore. I'm all over the place. I had to print something. But, uh, you know, I'm a scholar. Graduated with honors from Brigham Young University. I'm a phenomenal athlete. I mean, I was uh, won all kinds of national and world championships. Uh, uh, won the Pan American Games, four gold medals. The only one to ever do that in weightlifting at the Pan Ams. Uh, the following year, I went to the Olympic Games, competed with a bum knee, still damn near won the thing. But uh, uh, when this whole thing is over, it comes down to the pride of winning and the pride of, you know, preparing yourself for something like this. And you got to be deliberate, but you still have to be intimidating. And Jeremy London, I'm going to intimidate your ass, you little punk. I'm going to treat you like I treated... Hulk Hogan, like a red-headed stepchild. And, you know, tell him what to do if he didn't do it. I slapped him up, picked him up, body slammed him, dropped a big elbow on him. You know, put a hurting on him. Now, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that. I'm 79 years now, 79 years old now. But I think I can still do it. And uh, when we're all done with this, this tournament, it's a TKN Celebrity uh, Tournament, uh, and uh, uh, of 36, there's 36 vying for $11,000 grand prize. So when this, all the dust clears, Whoever's the victor is going to claim 11,000 bucks. And being 79 years of age on Social Security, can you believe it? I could use that 11,000 bucks. I could probably go buy, uh, I don't know, can't buy a car with 11,000. Uh, what the hell can I buy with $11,000? Well, in today's, uh, 
environment, uh, economic uh, environment. I don't think I can buy a whole hell of a lot with 11 grand, but I still value $11,000. So, you know, don't think that I'm not. But the, the main thing is the pride and the prize of 11,000 bucks. And uh, I'm really looking forward to it. You know, my last, my first opponent was uh, All-American and Hall of Famer, Gerald Briscoe. We had a knockdown, drag out uh, war, you know. And uh, so uh, <laughs> for you, for you uh, that missed it, you missed a hell of a show. And uh, so uh, anyway, I'm going to wrap it up right now. <coughs> and uh, see you guys at the tournament. And that will be, uh, let me get the date here. We're not, March 18th on the TKN Network. Don't you dare miss it. Talk to you then.